Hi everyone, this is Xing Li from Snap, a uh, creative vision team. So today I'm going to talk about uh, image all painting. So what is image all painting? Given any image, image all painting attempts to attain that image in any direction. Previous works handle the task with an image to image translation formulation. Image to image translation aims to learn the mapping between two visual domains. They set the given image as the source domain, uh, the outpainted image as the target domain, and try to learn the model to perform uh, the translation. So, what's the problem uh, with this kind of image to image formulations uh, in the image outpainting task? The model aims to learn the conditional distribution of the all painting region conditioned on the given regions. However, a uh, conditional context is quite strong in this task. The strong conditional context leads to an undesirable situation that uh, the generation overly dependent on uh, the input regions, leading to artifacts that uh, the all painting regions are either repetitive or just some simple extension uh, from the boundary. So in the first work, in and out diverse image all painting via gain inversion, uh, we attempt to tackle the aforementioned issues. Instead of modeling a test as a uh, image to image problem, that is a conditional generation task, we want to take advantage of the recent amazing progress of unconditional generation models, uh, for example, StyleGAN. Instead of directly generate uh, the all painting region, we first train an un un unconditional GAN. Then uh, we explore the latent space to find the latent vectors that can generate the desired, out uh, desired output. We want our pipeline to support diverse all painting and also uh, enable flexible user control. Uh, for example, we can assign uh, what category to be generated in uh, the all painting region. There are two different settings, non-categorical uh, non and categorical. And there are two stages, uh, generation stage and the inversion stage. So the first stage is to train uh, the generator. We adopt uh, the page-based generator as our backbone generator. The generator will generate uh, patches given different coordinates. Those patches are then concatenated to form uh, the final output. The second stage is to explore the latent space of the generator trained in the first stage. Uh, in order to find the latent vectors that can reconstruct uh, the given regions. In addition to the conventional L1 reconstruction loss uh, for GAN inversion, we further adopt prior loss to enforce the inverter, uh, inverted vectors uh, to be in uh, the training distribution. The prior loss encourages uh, the mean and the covariance of the inverse latent vector uh, to conform to the training statistic. And we also adopt uh, the mode seeking loss and the diversity losses. These two losses are used to enforce uh, the diverse uh, outpainting. Similarly, uh, for the categorical setting, the pipeline is uh, similar to the non-categorical one. The difference lies in the insertion of a category, uh, category information uh, to the input in both the training and also the inversion stage. Here are some visual results of a diverse all paintings uh, on the landscape dataset. You can see that uh, the results are realistic and diverse. Uh, no obvious artifacts can be seen as the boundary that is between the uh, given input and all painting area. 
Here are、uh, other results from the church dataset. So in addition to,、uh, to the natural landscape, we can also、uh, generate this kind of structure,、uh, structure scene. Our pipeline can support our painting、uh, from different directions,、uh, as shown at the as the、uh, first row that we can gen we can、uh, generate to the left to the top to the bottom、uh, from one patch, two patch, or th、uh, three patches, and we can even generate from irregular、uh, boundaries as shown in the bottom row. Here are some results of a categorical our painting. A、uh, user can sp specify what category they want to see、uh, in the all painting area.、Uh, for example,、uh, rock, waterfall, or even tower. Finally, by、uh, repeating the process iteratively,、uh, we can then perform the panorama generation. So. What's the problem with this math with this method?、Uh, for the in and out work, there are still some、uh, noticeable artifacts、uh, at the boundary, and the inversion is quite time consuming, especially、uh, for the panorama generations,、uh, where you need to like repeat the process for multiple times. It inspired us to explore a more fundamental problem:、uh, generating an、uh, infinite resolution image. Images we usually see、uh, in daily life and images in all datasets available are of limited size, so it they represent、uh, the partial observations of the environment. So we would like to explore whether it is possible for a model、uh, to be trained on this kind of limited size image, and can generate arbitrary size output. Therefore,、uh, we propose a novel framework, Infinity Gen. Infinity Gen is a generative adversarial learning framework that consists of a page generator and a page discriminator. Infinity Gen、uh, aims to synthesize infinite resolution images by parts independently, seamless,、uh, seamlessly, and memory efficient. The generator is composed of an Implicit function-based structure synthesizer and a fully convolutional、uh, texture synthesizer. A global latent variable is used to represent the holistic appearance of the implicit and the infinite resolution images. The global、uh, latent variable is applied to both the structural synthesizer and the textural synthesizer. Coordinates、uh, are used to query which part of the image、uh, to generate from the implicit representation. Then we use an additional local latent variable、uh, to represent the local variations of a structure. The structural synthesizer first synthesizes、uh, structural representations、uh, in the feature space. Then、uh, the fully convolutional you know, text、uh, texture synthesizer、uh, projects the individual structural feature to the image space、uh, independently. Notice that、uh, the spatially shaped、uh, local latent variables. Is、uh, spatially and arbitrarily extensible、uh, with a unique Gaussian prior. The discriminator is trained、uh, with the real and synthesized patches. In order to construct the correct vertical conditional you know, distributions of the patches, both the generator and the discriminator are trained、uh, with an additional auxiliary task, such that the discriminator predicts the vertical、uh, position of the patches. 
Okay, now uh, with a shear global latent variable, uh, a coordinate system, and uh, the generator can synthesize diverse patches subject to a uh, holistic appearance. The fully convolutional texture synthesizer assures uh, the independently synthesized patches can uh, seamlessly conform uh, to the scene. We further, we further demonstrate a spatial fusion generation paradigm. So given two global latents, We can smoothly fuse uh, the global latent variables into one image. Here is an example uh, generated by InfinityGAN. The model is trained on uh, 101 by 101 uh, size, and this sample is 1K by 2K. You can see that all regions uh, contain good structure and details. The structure synthesizer and the texture synthesizer separately model the image structure and texture with a high diversity. Here we demonstrate the diversity and the disentanglement uh, of the local latent variable and different styles. Here are more large size uh, images generated by uh, Infinity Gen. Here is the 2K by 2K samples, and here is a uh, 256 by 10K image if you concatenate all the, all the rows together. So now back to the outpainting task, uh, with the proposed Infinity GAN, we can now perform uh, better outpainting by combining Infinity GAN and uh, GAN inversion. With a, uh, with a trained Infinity GAN and a given real image, we can invert a latent variable that best reconstruct the real image with a gradient-based optimization. In particular, uh, we adopt a similar pipeline to the in and out. Then we can open the real image by sampling a spatially extended uh, local latent variable. So, by sampling different local latent variable, uh, we can achieve this kind of uh, multiple multimodality at no cost. Our methods naturally avoid the artifact introduced by the sequential outpainting procedure compared to previous work. Furthermore, uh, we can achieve image in, the, in betweening by combining the latent inversion and the spatial fusion generation. Our model can perform the in betweening at arbitrary distance. By setting the image size, uh, the same image on both sides uh, for the image in betweening, our model can synthesize horizontally cyclic panorama. Here are a few more samples on the panorama generation. In summary, uh, in the in and out work, uh, we achieve the image outpainting using GAN inversion technique instead of a conventional image to image formulation. Then, in the infinity GAN, we achieve the image synthesis of arbitrary resolution. We achieve it with a combination of a shear global variables diverse local latent variables and a coordinate system. Thank you for your listening.